There is no one cause of autism, just as there is no one type of autism. But no matter where your child is on the autism spectrum, the diagnosis can be frightening. It can be really lonely um, being a parent of a child with autism. It's hard to leave the house. We don't really go anywhere. You kind of have to force yourself to um, have a life outside of the home because it's hard, at least for me, to take my child out um, in public. Before therapy, Connors says Clayton was struggling with everyday activities. I was afraid that he wasn't bonding with me because I didn't feel like he really knew me. He just was very much in his own world. Therapists at St. Luke's Elks Rehab on Addison Avenue East have had great success with Clayton. Whoa! I'm going inside. You coming with us? To see my son start talking and <laughs> to say his first word and um, to, to give me a hug and he tells me I love you, that's insane. Um, the things he does with me, and it's because of Amy and the other therapist here, it's, <laughs> it's because of them. And I watch them and mimic them at home. And that's why he's doing so well. And we'll always have issues. He'll always be autistic. But his future is <laughs> much brighter now because of them. Connor says more education and compassion for autism is what's needed. These kids are so smart. We need to teach um, educators how to teach our children they're, because they're so smart. They just, they learn in a different way. For St. Luke's Health System, I'm Kevin Ryan reporting.